Welcome to Thoroughbred Action at Gulfstream Park. Brian Natto with you. It's closing weekend here of the Sunshine Meet. Of course, the championship meet, turf racing, kicks off Friday, December 1st. But we've got nine of them for you today. Big deal is $75,000 in the gross jackpot Rainbow Six. Gabe Pruitt's upstairs with the course and the weather conditions. We are at 79 degrees. Track is fast. We're under cloudy skies. Winds from the east at 7 miles per hour. Changes do begin to the first race. Scratch six, Sharp Pippa. Let's get to the first race today. Take out number six, Sharp Pippa. And uh, they are off. Friday Little Lifter from Gulfstream. There goes Subtle Faith out to quickly there. In between the uh, Phillies, Corzada. Also broke sharply there as they run across the uh, backstretch and towards the uh, far turn. Zuli Bella, part of the early mix there up at the outside with four of the thrill. To her outside, Chabru, laying just off the uh, leaders there in the uh, fifth spot at the outside. Tutu you all races in six. The favorite, AJ's memory, has eight lengths to make up now through an opening quarter at 23 and two as they run out of the far turn. The long shot, Corazona, still there. Zuli Bella turns up the pressure there. Second for the thrill. Three wide third, but just a half length off the lead. Subtle faith in heavy traffic. Chiru starts to uh, generate some offense. She now swings out four wide as Tootaloo you all stays ground and still six further back to AJ's memory as they race past the half and 47 and two. Top of the stretch, Subtle faith trying to click, kick clear down at the inside. Tootaloo you all try to rally on it between Phillies there as Chiru continues to inch in down the center of the track late, but it's Subtle faith. Subtle faith still four clear. Chiru rallies into second. Tootaloo you all third. It is Subtle Faith here, the opener at 5-1. to one. Chiru checks in a second. AJ's memory rallied late to be third. Toodaloo, y'all, fourth, 112. And uh, they are off. It's a nice level beginning, and Mish is spreading out quickly there from the center of the uh, track as they run out of the uh, back chute. It was outside. Slim, slow slider is there with the east side cool. Also part of the early skirmish there. They're three across the uh, track as they move on to the uh, main track, the back stretch. Morgan Point is running in fourth, about three lengths off the top trio. That's Big Daddy Dave. To his inside, and it's far back to lightning tones. He's about 15 lengths behind the top flight. The quarter was up in 23 and 3. Mish continues to flaunt that early speed across the back stretch. East side cool. Applying steady pressure there. To his outside, he's three parts of a length back. Second, slim, slow slider. Tucked in just off the dueling pair there in third. It's about four lengths back to Big Daddy Dave. He's ready gone in fourth right now. Five and a half lengths off the lead. As Morgan Point starts to drop back and still far back to lightning tones as they move around the far turn. The half is 45 and three. Mish still via target. Slim, slow slider. Right there, though, to his outside second. It's four further back to east side cool. He'll need to heat up soon, but starts to drift wide in third. Big Daddy Dave there at the inside and fourth. And lightning tones from far back starts to thread through horses. Three quarters and 109 and three. The favorite Mish put to the test here. Slim, slow slider. Still try to surge past late. Lightning Tones rallies into third. Four outside. That's east side cool. Fourth. Mish battles on with slim, slow slider. Lightning Tones is surging late. Mish so close to home. Here's Lightning Tones lunging late. Mish or Lightning Tones. Very close there. They got very tight at the wire. Mish there at the inside. Lightning Tones lunging late. Slim, slow slider was third in 136 and two.
three by four and moving away. And uh, they are off. Applause sprints out from the center, but Sergeant Motley kicks it to gear dead at the inside, and Sergeant Motley will take over the early lead. Love, Moppy Love. Right there, she'll tuck down at the inside second, the great beach land. Moves up down to the center of the track. That is Sickle Dance, who's out there running part of the early group with applause. Down driving back in the fifth, and it's about five further back to Charging Lady. At the back of the pack, the quarter was 22 and 2. It's Sergeant Motley who fronts the field out of the far turn. Sergeant Motley maintaining a length margin from Beachland there on the outside second. Sickle Dance there in third. Two links off the lead and three wide right now is Love Mobby Love. Is that urging at the fourth spot? Charging Lady starts to move up off the back and applause is last. Top of the stretch. Sergeant Motley continues to command the field. The half is 46 seconds. Sergeant Motley trying to go all the way. Beachland is giving futile chase there so far in second. Sickle Dance rallies into third. Four outside. That's Charging Lady who moves up into fourth but Sergeant Motley. Sergeant Motley sharp today. It's Sergeant Motley. She would have decisively all the way. Sickle Dance was second. Charging Lady finished third, Beachland held fourth at 104 and three. And uh, they are off. Tis a fast bullet, fast leaving. There are the outside 16 cigarettes also left sharply with Vince Sanity that was inside. Sabian is a four wide. There's a four across, across the back stretch. As they run towards the far turn, come dream with me as we pick up there between horses. Papalote moves through that at the inside with the tour guide. In between those two, it's a break of two links back to Old Flag. The first time starters out right again, seventh, five clear of Multi Narrow as they were through an opening quarter in 23 and two. Arrow Ghost is out to last as they go around the far turn. Vincentity there at the inside, but it's a Sabian who continues to swing up there. Those two match strides around the far turn is 16 cigarettes. Paco tries to light the fuse there up three wide. Come dream with me is four wide fourth. They cut the quarter here and turn for home. Sabian trying to overhaul Vincentity. Vincentity tries to counter and quicken though dead at the inside. It's Sabian with a short lead. Vincentity trying to battle back. Vincentity or Sabian. These two in a fist fight dead to the finish. Sabian's the outside. Sabian is surging. Sabian up to get it. Vincentity was second. Come dream with me. Finished third. Old flag fourth. And uh, they are off. Tap in your beer. Broke well there. Legend hustles on through there. It was inside. The center capture the laughter. Also out there to uh, five for early supremacy as they run out of the back, shooting towards the uh, main track. Legend's dead at the inside. Tap in your beer. The favorite right there, second. Capture the laughter is up three wide third with travel guide four wide the fourth spot. Shot in. Right off the top flight there in fifth with Il Malandrito. Caught wide in the uh, sixth spot. Danley's in between horses. Is across the back stretch and towards the far turn. The opening quarter was 24 and one fifth seconds. And up top, it is Legend. The long shot loose on the lead. Tap any Revere, though, right there. Second. Capture the blaster. A threatening third. Just off the top here. That's Travel Guide that was outside in fourth. It's a break of a two back to run and block. Continues on there at the inside from a fifth as they move around the turn. Dan Lee. Is uh, out last now. The half is up in 47 into one. Tap Andy Rebeer up alongside Legend. Capture the laughter. Still just off that top here. He begins to uh, 
Swing up three wide. It's four back to shot 10. Run and block has saved all the ground out at the inside with Il Maldondrito still five off the top, turning for home. Three quarters and one, 12 and one. Capture the laughter. Trying to coddle the favorite. Tap in your beer. It's Capture the Laughter who's taken over and looking to kick clear. Tap in your beer is their second shot 10. Now running on late there in the third spot. Running block is fourth. Capture the laughter. Capture the Laughter is up to a wedded. Barboza Trades run 1-2. Catch the Laughter scores. Happen your beer was second shot and third running block. Fourth at 138-2. They are off. Curlin's cruising. Came out well that at the inside. Hot and lucky. Also a left for good early position there with Praiseworthy to his outside. Grant Hammer will swing out of the turn there at the inside of fourth. Battle of Dovers to his outside in fifth. Mayor Jack is next in front of San Pirodu. And at the back of the pack, Inspiring Otter right now double digits off the lead. As they circle the opening turn, it's Curlin's cruising. On top here, Curlin's cruising by the opening quarter in 25 seconds. Grand Haber just off the leader there in the second spot. It's a break of two and a half links. Todd Lucky runs on third. That's Battle of Dover down at the inside fourth. Praiseworthy's up fifth right now, five off the top in front of Mayor Jack, who's next in sixth, San Pirodu. Still followed, we get about four and a half clear of Inspiring Otter as they run across the back stretch and towards the far turn. And up top, Curlin's cruising. Continues to call the shots by the half and 49 and two. Grant Haber dials up the pressure there, a notch of the outside second, just a neck off the leader with Hot and Lucky. Running just off the top pair from third. Mayor Jack moves through in tight traffic. Praiseworthy to his outside three wide fifth. Battle of Dover saving ground in sixth with San Pirodu next. It's still far back here to Inspiring Otter. About eight lengths behind the pack as they run around the far turn. Curlin's cruising and Grand Haber. They continue to go at it here. Three wide advancing up. Hot and lucky. Four wide praiseworthy. Three quarters, one fourteen and one. It's wide open here turning for home. Grand Haber short lead. Hot and lucky though started to heat up with Praiseworthy. Way out wide. Here comes Sin Pirodu from far back. Is it move through the uh, stretch there? Grand Tower trying to fight back dead at the inside. Hold the phone. San Pirodu is still charging. San Pirodu on the outside. San Pirodu was up to wet it from far back. Grand Tower finished in second. Tight for third. Praiseworthy or hot and lucky at 145 and 1. And uh, they are off. A nice level beginning. Fairhope Curly pushes on through there towards the inside. That is a bubbly champagne. Give her outside there with the bars at Legacy. Also looking to mix it up there. So those three across the track as they run towards the far turn. Katie Kate just off the top trio. She is fourth. She's three clear of madness in good bright flames. Still plenty of work to do as the Phillies run out of the uh, turn. The quarter was up in 22 and two. That's Fairhope Curly a short lead dead at the inside. DeMar's legacy though begins to uh, step up there on the outside. So those two matching strides, the favorite bubbly champagne trying to work out in tight traffic. That's Katie Kate to Brown outside. It's three back to madness and further back to good bright flames who's outlast. They cut the quarter and turn for home. That is Fairhope 
Curley at the inside, but it's DeMar's legacy who has taken over. They're past the half, 46 and 1, and DeMar's legacy is looking to kick clear. Bubbly Champagne is free of eight. She runs on to the second. DeMar's legacy still there maintaining the lead. Bubbly Champagne is inching in. DeMar's legacy is almost home. DeMar's legacy digs in there to take it narrowly from Bubbly Champagne. Madness third. That was Good Bright Flames on the scene late to be fourth in 105 flat. And uh, they are off. A nice level beginning from the center of the track. America, of course, looks to dart out to quickly there. Damn a wonder. To her inside there. Come out running in close. Sweet temptation. Also part of the early uh, battles of across the uh, backstretch. Anatomy is in between fillies. Far outside atomically. Part of the early uh, fray as they race wide across the uh, course here, across the backstretch and towards the far turn. That's America, of course, who has the lead. Sweet temptation right there. And advancing up now in second. Anatomy right off the uh, leaders there in the uh, third spot. That is atomically up at the outside fourth. Hi. Hello. How are you? Is dead at the inside. Deborindo running up uh, there is sixth. It's uh, two back to a dim a wonder. And next, the misses and out the back of the pack links the quarter was 22 and four. America, of course, under pressure from Sweet Temptation atomically begins to rally up three wide high. Hello. How are you? Try to split horses there as they run to the top of the stretch and by the half, 45 and two. Dead at the inside, a sh short lead for America, of course. Hi. Hello. How are you? Upset minded in between Phillies atomically. Up on the outside, a three way thriller. Here's atomically who bursts to the scene late. Hi. Hello, how are you? Did not have enough. Atomically going best. Atomically. Was up to win it from high. Hello, how are you? American, of course, finished third. Sweet Temptation fourth in 117 and one. Sadie Bear moves on through there in between horses. Flirt Hitty uh, fired up early there as well as they uh, race towards the uh, far turn. At the extreme outside, Chloe's Toy. It was also out alertly as Chanticum running in the uh, fourth spot. That's Princess Blakely who's pinned down fifth. She spiffled alongside. Vincative is up three wide for the Love Rhapsody. Defending at the back of the pack there as they run onto the far turn. Flirtiti fronts the field here in the finale. It's Flirtiti on top. Chloe's toy is right there second. Three wide. Chata moves up now third as Sadie Bear looms just off the top trio. She'll need a place to race dead at the inside. Princess Blakely moves up fifth. Defendants on the scene there from the back. They were through a quarter of 21 and three. Flirtiti trying to shake loose on top here. Sadie Bear is inching in down the center of the track. Chata's up on the outside. It's still Flirtiti, but here's Sadie Bear in between. Chata's surging late. It's going to be Sadie Bear. Chata on the outside. Chata is lunging late. Chata in the finale. Chata was up to again. It's Sadie Bear had to settle for second once more. Far back third. Flirtiti there with Princess Blakely at 57 and 4.
that's a wrap on the nine race Friday card. We will close down the Sunshine Meet Saturday. 11 races, the traditional 12-10 post. We hope to see you out here at beautiful Gulfstream Park.